Welcome to a tutorial on making a hiking staff medallion or design on your hiking staff and finishing and making a hiking staff. Today we're going to look at several different hiking staves. Now these are purchased dowels that have been stained or painted and have had medallions put on them. This is a very fun uh, activity and one that I highly recommend. Some people like to go out in the woods and find a really nice stick uh, which is a great thing to do if you uh, have the time and patience to clean it off and make sure it's sturdy and perhaps even carve on it a little bit. This particular dowel <coughs> excuse me, was purchased at a Boy Scout shop. You can get these for six dollars. Uh, so it makes a very nice stick and again very affordable. This one here is my favorite. I use it all the time and this one is actually a broom handle and you can see the broom handle part over here. This is, was left with its original varnish finish and I've attached a lot of medallions as well as a hand grip and we also have um, on this actually a little compass glued in the top. So it's just a very nice stick that I use an awful lot. And I want to show you here, you can make your own, we'll call them medallions, by taking your favorite designs and shrinking them down and making them medallion size on your printer. And then you can polyurethane them onto your hiking stave. Now when you are putting these on, what I recommend doing is putting a coat of polyurethane on and then, or varnish or whatever you're going to use, clear varnish, and rolling these prior so that they're curved automatically so that they'll stick on that very well. Place them on there and then add several more layers of polyurethane or varnish to protect them. On your hiking staff medallions, when you're putting those on, I would recommend that you get a smaller stick or dowel and mold these around them so that they are bent a little bit more than they need to be bent to attach to your stick. And that way when you place them on there, they won't have a tendency to lift. Also you might want to place your nails uh, on there, mark it where the nails go through and drill a small hole or tap a smaller nail through there to give a guide hole when you're putting those on so that you don't damage the hiking staff medallion with your hammer. Using a nail finisher tool uh, to push the nails in at the final part also helps. This is my wife's hiking stick and you can see we've applied a leather strap here that she can put her hand through when she's walking so you can kind of rest your arm with this stick and again you want to make sure that your stick, that the area that you place your hand on the stick has nothing rough on it like the raised medallions. So I have a leather grip on mine. My wife prefers to have just the regular wood for her to hold. She, her hand fits that better. You can finish these with stain. This one was burnt a little bit with a torch uh, to give it a little unique look. Uh, you can paint them. Uh, again, whatever you decide. On this one, the polyurethane is put on nice and heavy where the hand grip would be, and you can grip this over the polyurethane so you can actually have your designs or, or medallions placed right over the uh, hand grip area on something like this. So this is a very quick tutorial on doing this and creating your own custom designs on your walking stick. I'd also like to mention that when you get your sticks, test them out on a steep hill or grade going up and down to make sure they're comfortable where your hand goes on them and that they are strong enough to support your weight. You always want to make sure that the stick is going to uh, be of complete service to you and it's not going to wear blisters on your hand or be too heavy. A lot of hardwoods can be very heavy and might be heavier than you want for a walking stick. But these are things you'll determine. So you've now seen multiple styles of uh, design and such on sticks. And again, uh, 
how to put your own unique touches to the stick by simply taking your favorite designs and polyurethaning them on the stick. And it doesn't have to be totally medallion shaped. It can be of any uh, shape that you want. So you have a number of these options. There are a lot of places that sell medallions. Hike America is a wonderful place to go for affordable medallions. They make medallions for scenic sites in all 50 states and even other parts of the world. There are other companies that offer medallions in, in various quantities and designs and shapes or even custom design them if you have a group that wants their own medallion. Again, wonderful thing to do with your walking stick or, or, or hiking stave and I strongly encourage you if you do go out hiking and you're going to be on rough terrain a hiking stick can be invaluable. It acts as an extra leg like a tripod for you when you're on unsteady ground, loose rocks, going over fallen trees or brush and it also uh, offers you a nice way to create a memory stick for yourself, uh, putting unique things on for the various places you've been. Good luck with your walking sticks and we'll see you next time.